meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And tonight we're expecting to see temperatures in the 60s, but the uh, chance of some heavier rain is definitely on the rise. Showers, and there could even be a little thunder thrown into the mix this evening, too. Temperatures backing off to 60 degrees at 11 o'clock. Still some rain around tonight, and we'll see some lingering showers tomorrow morning, 52 at 8, 54 at noon. Rain ending around lunchtime or early afternoon, and then at 5 o'clock, we should even be back to partly cloudy skies and 60 degrees with skies clearing out tomorrow evening. And Tomorrow night. Weather headlines tonight. We'll see some rain heavy at times. As I mentioned, that chance of thunder. Windy conditions on Friday, especially in the afternoon. And then some more rain comes back, mainly Saturday night. So a good part of the day, Saturday dry. Most of Sunday during the day looks dry too. The timing just the way it should be, like Camelot. Rain only comes at night. Here's your forecast for the rainfall amounts tonight. Uh, we're going to be tacking on some more precipitation out there as we head through the overnight hours and into tomorrow. And once again, areas could be picking up anywhere from an inch to another inch and a half of precipitation here across the western portions of Ohio. And low temperatures eventually hitting the upper 40s and low 50s in our area. And then high temperatures tomorrow afternoon uh, getting up around 60. We may get up between 60 and 65 if the clouds break soon enough. That'll be the tricky part tomorrow afternoon. Here's your SVG Chevrolet camera. You can see some of the rain streaking out of the clouds. Some rain falling up in Dark County and Greenville. And you can see the wet roadways there. So far, the rainfall totals haven't been real high. We've seen a couple tenths of an inch around Springfield, tenth of an inch in New Carlisle, and a tenth of an inch in Brookville. Most areas about a quarter to up to about a half inch, four tenths of an inch below Stetters over in Jamestown. Uh, the rain, at least for the time being, has moved mostly north of I-70, but you can see a shower in Warren County. That's moving uh, north and northeastward, and then more rain filling back into the west of us, too. Here's the rain tonight. Sydney, Rushi, over to Greenville, uh, Gettysburg, and Versailles. You're seeing some rain up there in Dark County. And then more showers and even a few thunderstorms filling in across southern Indiana and northern Kentucky. Rain will continue to develop here and spread north and northeastward into the area. And this time when the rain comes in, some of that could be heavy. We have a warm front lifting northward tonight, low pressure center coming out of southern Illinois. That combination is going to spell uh, the situation for some wet conditions around the Miami Valley tonight. 65 in Dayton, east wind at 6 miles per hour. Dew points up there looking more like spring in the low 60s. 90% the relative humidity. Temperatures up north, upper 50s. We have upper 60s in the southern part of our viewing area. Here's that rain tonight. Looks like some pretty decent rainfall this evening. Still some rain tonight and showers around tomorrow morning, but finally that clearing coming in from the northwest later tomorrow afternoon and evening. Rain tonight could be heavy at times. Might even have some thunder thrown in there, especially early tonight, low temperature 52. Tomorrow we'll see the showers ending around midday or early afternoon with the clouds breaking. In the afternoon, high near 60, gusty northwest winds 15 to 25, 50s in the morning, making it up to around 60 later in the day. And your forecast for Saturday will be down to 40 in the morning, high temperature 62, chance of mainly late day rain, uh, 60 on Sunday, and looks like a mostly dry day. More rain back Monday and Tuesday, highs in the 60s, and we could see some showers and thunderstorms Wednesday and Thursday, but all the way up into the 70s after all.